Factorio is a game full of math, ratios, and efficiency. Three things I haven't thought about since high school. But that's okay. I had my chance to back out when my boyfriend dug out his old graphing calculator. But don't let a bunch of numbers and equations scare you from Factorio day night. The factory must grow. When we go on a Factorio deep dive, I feel and sound a lot smarter than I probably am. I start using words like throughput and equilibrium and get all sophisticated. My boyfriend will rattle off some plan about a main bus and like a thing with red chips. One particle of unitanium has a nuclear reaction with a flux capacitor. Carry the two changing its atomic isotoner into a radioactive spider. Fuck you, science! Factorio is all about balance, so symmetry is a big thing when we play this game. My boyfriend's sort of haunted by perfection, so it kind of ruffles his feathers when I just start scribbling outside the lines. Too bad, we're here to have fun. I think Factorio inflicted lethal damage on his OCD. Fun fact, if something about this picture bothers you, ask your doctor if dating is right for you. This game is great because we really get to put our cooperation to the test. We use a lot of divide and conquer strategies to get our work done. Okay, you're in charge of green chips, all right? So you need one iron plate and three copper wire. So you need to put a splitter on the copper. Does that make sense? Uh-huh. I'm not gonna be neat and tidy, but he knows what he's signing up for. I'm more than capable of getting the job done. It's just gonna be a lot of confusing spaghetti. Fortunately, your girl likes the taste of Italian. Why isn't this working? Well, it'd help if the belts were facing the right way. <laughs> I've been called the queen of temporary arrays on a handful of occasions, because when I'm not handcrafting everything, I'm breaking equilibrium to run a belt to one of my secret projects. What? What is this? Those are my pipes. Your pipes? Is there a particular reason you need a box filled <laughs> with pipes? I love running along a belt and scooping up all the little plates and gears. I always end up with way more stuff than I bargained for. When I don't know what to do with the mountains and mountains of coal in my bag, I drop them off in a not so discreet garbage chest somewhere. There are literal trash cans littering our factory and he'll never find them all. Did you put a box down here? Did you find my coal? This has iron. He's told me about a thousand times how to drop stuff back on the belt, but I can never remember. Obviously I can't ask or he'll know I've been stealing gears again. I feel like the bots are better at this than me. Well, they do put stuff back in the right spot. <laughs> <laughs> but don't worry, those plates will find their way back on the belt one way or another. The girl has her ways. Sometimes my genius is... It's almost frightening. But my all-time favorite thing to do in Factorio is be the exterminator. Let Poindexter over there crunch the numbers in his calculator. We've got some bugs to squash. Although, I'm forced to admit my methods may be questionable. and not optimized in the slightest. Shit. <laughs> to be honest, I don't know who was doing more damage there. There are miles and miles of belts running out to the middle of nowhere carrying ammo for my turrets. Some say still to this day. It's not the most elegant way to kill the biters, but it does get the job done. My boyfriend puts up with a lot of my tomfuckery when it comes to screwing up his plans in this game. Around the time we start getting vehicles though, we see the beginning of the end to our factory. I can't really blame him. I'd be mad if I was hit by a train every five minutes too. Also, I think they should pull my license because I can't drive for shit. Who broke it? I'd say we usually go to bed salty with each other, but if you've ever played Factorio, you know you don't actually sleep. Instead, we just passive aggressively build walls to keep each other out. Now hand me that big old rock, the one that looks like your head. As much as we love this game, it can pretty quickly take over our lives if we aren't careful. It's always important to remind each other that it's more important to have fun than build a damn rocket. What do you think of the roller coaster? We. When do we get to the ride? This is the ride! Like any relationship, Factorio's all about setting boundaries. When you're considering playing this game as a couple for date night, make sure you remember why you love each other. Those aren't your gears, they're our gears. And I promise I won't touch the goddamn power poles. Now come on already, we gotta launch this rocket before dinner gets here. Ow!